Hi friends, welcome to Graphics Tutorials. Today we are going to discuss about color harmonies. Indeed, we have discussed about softwares, but while working with softwares, the major problem that we face or come along is the combination of colors. When to use what color? So that is the reason for which we are going to know about the color harmonies today. Ascade will learn uh, about colors in very simple formats. So in general when we are asked about colors we generally say red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet. These are the by default colors that comes to our mind. But actually the color wheel or the series or numbers of colors are much more compared to these uh, general colors that we can recall. What happens when we design or when we start designing something we wait or we have to observe colors or we have to just recall what the color was or what color should we give to give it a proper or a professional look that happens because throughout the days our eyes soak millions of colors so when we are going to make the detail we face problem as because we fail to use the memory and that is why we just wait and we just use our time unnecessarily thinking that what are the combinations that will look better or what are the colors that will be that we should mix or what are the things or how to do it so that is the why that is the reason why we are going to use this color harmony so this is a color wheel uh, and this is a very important part of our color harmony you can just directly download it from any of the sites these are easily available in any of the sites say for example Google now the color so this was a color wheel that we talked about but there are several colors or we can divide our colors into three major division one is the primary color the secondary color and the tertiary color now what are the primary colors according to this wheel our primary colors are red blue and yellow and what are the secondary colors the colors that come in between primary colors say for example in between red and yellow here comes the secondary color that is orange from red and blue we have the secondary color called purple from blue and yellow we have the secondary color green now the third color is the tertiary color tertiary color is basically the color between primary and secondary color say for example red and purple are my primary and secondary color respectively and the tertiary color is the red purple similarly blue and purple are my primary and secondary color and my tertiary color is blue purple similarly here we have blue and green and the tertiary color is blue green similarly green and yellow yellow green yellow and orange orange yellow orange and red orange red so these are our primary, secondary and tertiary colors. This is done in a very simple format. One more difference we can get is if we turn the, our uh, color wheel, see these are our warmer colors and these are our cool colors. This also plays a very important part while designing a graphic design or a logo especially. Now today we are going to discuss about 6 color harmonies which work really very well and you can start working with it. Now our first color harmony is monochromatic. Now what is monochromatic? Monochromatic means one single color scheme. Say for example this blue which I have highlighted. So you can go on with any of the shades which belong to these uh, blue or you can take this red. See as you go in between the center it is getting lighter so you can use this gradation of the color or you can use the tint of the color say for example this is done in a very simplified way so you can use this tints so the speciality of monochromatic is only one color best used for a single subject and it helps to create an atmospheric effect now the next color harmony is analogous 
what is analogous if you take the color wheel the color wheel or the colors adjacent on the wheel say for example if you select this color the next two colors immediate if you take this color this immediate color or if you take this these two immediate colors so it's up to you that how do you select the series or the adjacent colors on the wheel so see color adjacent on the wheel easy on eyes because these this is a very smoothing combination of colors it can be used for peaceful comfortable mood used or seen in nature right now the third one is triadic what is triadic if you take the color wheel you can have this y shape symbol or a compass kind of thing and you can just move it like this say y 1 2 and 3 you turn it like this this one this one and this one right so 1 2 3 okay so this can be your body combination this is equal distance on your color wheel and this is best for cartoon designing or cartoon characters if you are using this one so this one this one and this one so this is a very simple format so one thing we can do is uh, you, if you select a color say like this then you take three steps say for example one is the main color so one two and three the image the next one you select this one two and three so this will be the color okay now the fourth one is your complementary color now what is complementary color complementary color is a primary color and a complementary color or the colors which are directly opposite on your color wheels say for example if i take this primary color purple is your complementary color which is directly opposite to your color wheel if i take this orange so this will be your complementary color if i take this color this will be your complementary color so complementary color means any color you can select from your color wheel and the complementary color will be just the opposite color which is on your color wheel see opposite on your wheel very popular naturally pleasing to eyes use one predominantly don't use the color in equal proportion one less than two that means if you are using yellow and you, if you are using purple then don't mix the color or the ratio shouldn't be like 50% of yellow and 50% of purple it should be say 60% of yellow 40% of purple or vice versa or you can take this as 90% 10% you can also mix it as 80% 20% so don't mix any of the complementary colors in equal proportions and if you talk about the other combinations of the colors no matter whatever color wheel or color harmony you are using don't ever mix the colors in equal proportions say for example if i use, if i am using these three colors so for a proc 33.333 and something so you can't mix this 33 33 33 and all what you have to do is say for example if you take this as 50 you can use this as 30 20 similarly for your triadic for your complementary and this is applicable for any of the color harmonies or color patterns if you want to do so never mix colors in equal proportions and now the fifth one that is split complementary split complementary means if you are taking any other color so say for example this color and the complementary will be this one but you won't be taking this apart from this you extend the ends so you will be getting this color and this color so it is actually like a v-shape say for example if you take this blue this will be your complementary color but you are not going to take this complementary color just extend your ends so this will be your complementary color and this will be your complementary color so one two and three similarly if you take this one this will be your complementary color don't take this take this one and this one okay 
सो सिमिलर टू कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री बट वन एंड एक्सटेंडेड मोर क्रिएटिव फ्रीडम फील्स लाइवली एंड जॉयस ओके नाउ वी कम टू आर लास्ट कलर हार्मनी फॉर टूडे सेशन दैट इज कॉल्ड टेट्रैटिक और डबल कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री दिस वन इज अ बिट कॉम्प्लिकेटेड बट वी आर गोइंग टू टेक इट इन अ वेरी ईजी वे ओके सी फॉर एग्जाम्पल दिस इज अ कलर सो नेचुरली दिस विल बी द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर फॉर अस देन वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज वी आर गोइंग टू स्किप द इमीजियर नेक्स्ट कलर एंड वी आर गोइंग टू टेक द नेक्स्ट कलर एंड वी आर गोइंग टू टेक द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर ऑफ दैट इमीजियट नेक्स्ट कलर सो दिस विल बी द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर से फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ आई टेक दिस कलर सो द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर विल बी दिस नाउ इफ वी टेक द नेक्स्ट कलर दैट इज दिस वन वी आर गोइंग टू लीव दिस एंड वी आर गोइंग टू टेक दिस वन एंड द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर ऑफ दिस विल बी दिस सो आर कॉम्बिनेशन विल बी वन टू थ्री एंड फोर इफ आई टेक दिस वन दिस कलर द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर विल बी दिस वी आर गोइंग टू लीव वन फ्रॉम दिस एंड नाउ दिस वन सो वन टू थ्री एंड फोर राइट सो वन टू थ्री एंड फोर सो दिस विल बी द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर सो एज बिकॉज वी आर टेकिंग टू कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर्स सो दिस इज कॉल्ड डबल कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री कलर सो टू पेयर्स ऑफ ऑपोजिंग कलर्स बेस्ट यूज फॉर फोरग्राउंड एंड बैकग्राउंड नेवर यूज ट्वेंटी परसेंट ऑफ ईच एज सेट अर्यर दैट एज बिकॉज वी आर मिक्सिंग फोर कलर्स सो डोंट टेक द प्रपोर्शन टू ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव जस्ट एक्सपेरिमेंट विथ योर कलर्स से टेन ट्वेंटी एंड यू कैन डिवाइड द रेस्ट हार्ड एंड वेरी प्लीजिंग ओके सो इन नट शेल इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द कलर हारमोनीज अगेन सो वी डिस्कस अबाउट मोनोक्रोमैटिक विच वॉज वन कलर एनालॉगस एडजस्टिंग कलर्स ट्रायडिक equal distant colors complementary opposing colors split complementary one complementary and extended and double complementary two pairs of opposing colors so that was all folks for graphics tutorial just go through this video once again so that you can have a better experience with the colors subscribe to my channel graphics tutorials Thank you for watching.